great mercy on this soon is a high risk venture. Emergencies can occur at any time. My name is Dr. Frank Ogonna Akabudu. I'm a senior consultant physician and gynecologist and the chief medical director of New Greenland Specialist Hospital, which is located at Sarukiyaki Street in Southern Girikano. There in Kano, we know about maternal mortality, which is very high. Nigeria has one of the worst maternal mortality rates in the whole world, which nationally is put at about uh, 600 deaths per 100,000. As abysmal as it may be, there is a very wide variation regionally. But in the north generally, the statistics are so abysmal. We cannot say that the worst maternal mortality rate all over the country. The main problem with maternal mortality is that they present as emergencies. Pregnancy on its own is a high risk venture. Obstetric emergencies can occur at any time, from the time of conception to the time when the pregnancy is fully termed between labor and delivery, and even up to 42 days post delivery. As we are an obstetrician and gynecologist practicing here in Canada, I and some of my colleagues thought of how best we can help to solve this problem. We actually started this hospital in 2009. We have facilities for conducting normal labor, for surgical intervention, and the full laboratory services. We have maintained that standard, and the goodwill is there, and we thank God for that. But beyond that, the majority of people that need study services are living in rural areas. Availability of essential drugs that are needed for uh, comprehensive surgery uh, are not always available in all the centers. It is available quite all right, but the supply chain can be erratic sometimes. We have a blood banking system here, but the supply of blood is not always there. And sometimes you have adverse uh, outcomes as a result of not having life saving blood at the critical time that they are needed. From the time we started more than 40 years ago, I know what it takes to have a bleeding case at night or even at any time of the day. The importance of life bank cannot be overestimated. I've had situations where I order for blood and within 10 minutes, 15 minutes, the blood comes. We don't have problem of access to blood again. Times are very hard in the country now. It is still very common for people to run into an emergency unit without any cobble. We should always know when our services are needed, purely for humanitarian purposes, and do that for the sake of the vocation we are practicing. <laughs>